Welcome back to the Road Show this morning. The buzz, it is official. The Christmas crunch is on, and some of you may still have some shopping to do since yesterday's storm <laughs> hampered a lot of people's plans. But we actually headed out to Warwick Mall and found that people weren't really deterred by the weather. Nice. Take a look. Well, we just came here to get a few Christmas presents for yeah. our friends and, and family. And family, and maybe yeah. a few stuff for us if we yeah. have any money left over. We went out there today, and it yeah. was like crazy. It was like. Our feet it was, was like, like we were yeah. very half up. Yeah. It was a, it was very bad. Very bad. <laughs> not too bad. Roads weren't bad. Kind of rough on Route Three, but not bad. It was like crazy. <laughs> I might just maybe get something for me too. Well, I maybe. have to say, listen, they're they're learning young because it's usually one for you, one for me, one for you when I'm sh when I'm going Christmas yeah. shopping, you know. Um, but you know, people did brave the storm to get everything done, and I was wondering if you guys were done with your shopping. I've got a little. I've got little things like mm. uh, for the uh, mail carrier, that yeah. sort of thing. Yeah. But um, I actually made the mistake of coming onto Route Six on Saturday, uh -oh. Oh boy. which was a zoo. Nuts. It was <laughs> yeah. so crazy. I had to stop by the station, did a little bit of work here, mm -hmm. picked up a camera to take home for the storm yesterday. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I was trying to figure out, you know, come up with my best plan. So I, I didn't go my normal way down Route Six. I tried to just get as quickly as I could to the highway, and it took me 20 minutes to go oh. about a half and a, a oh half a mile. Oh my gosh. Nightmare. What about you? So have shopping to do? Yeah, well, here's the thing. My dad, I've, I've tried shopping for my dad before. I bought him Red Sox tickets. He won't even go to the game. Like, he doesn't like going to stuff like that. Really? So he's like, Sean, all I want is a card. So shopping for dad, shopping for mom, very easy. Uh, I shop for the kids is what I do. All, okay. all like, my nieces and nephews, I, I go to the... Uh, the Disney store, don't watch the show today, kids. Uh, and uh, and I, you know, I got some something because they're big fans of cars and yeah. Wally and stuff like that. So that's who I shop for, really. And, and you know, the rest, uh, I, I do cards, or, and I'm, I'm anti-gift card. Let it be known. Okay, why is that? It, 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 basically, you're taking your currency that's good everywhere. Yeah. And then you're limiting it, limiting it to one place. Yeah. You know. So you just want us to hand you cash, basically, is what well, you're saying. Well, not me cash. I'm just saying, <laughs> just in general, like if you're gonna if you're gonna give uh, you know a hundred dollar gift card to Walmart or something or or to Best Buy, you know, what if there's a better deal at Walmart? You can't take that and use it at Walmart. That's why you know? sometimes I'll get one of those Visa gift cards or and you know when you go to like Stop and Shop there and, and those places, they yeah. have a lot of different uh, gift cards for different. You know, if you're tailoring to someone who really does like. Then something. you have to be be careful because after a year they start charging you a fee and they deduct from yeah, it. Yeah, in some in some areas in some states, and we're, yeah. and we're uh, included in that, unfortunately. You do all yours online, so you must have most finished of, up. Yeah, most of my, my shopping I do online. I, I like shopping online typically. Uh, this year, I just handed out today the um, Christmas presents to the to the crew, which was a bottle of melatonin <laughs> so that everybody can get to sleep, and a gift card to Dunkin' no, Donuts or Starbucks. Let me know, a gift card yeah. to D D Dunkin' Donuts is different because okay. you can't. Oh, well, oh, no, no, no. Oh, now coffee, he's, coffee. he's, he's backtracking. Yeah, no, here's little the thing: bit. because it's you know you have you have um you know if there's a plasma screen at one place right. and there's a plasma same plasma screen at another place. It's cheaper. That's one thing. But Dunkin' Donuts coffee only available. At Dunkin' Donuts, and we thank you for sponsoring the show. <laughs> but I have to say, you know, Courtney, what's funny is uh, when I was giving out these these gifts this morning, Ashley, our producer, was saying to me, "Wow, you're so organized, and you're on the ball and everything." And I said, "Listen, this has only been the last couple of years since I've been married because I've been down to the wire Christmas Eve shopping. He is much more organized than I am, and that's the only reason why I, I think I even made it out of bed this morning." <laughs> it's usually one in the relationship, right? You go either yeah. way, last minute or something. Yang, right? Got it under control around Thanksgiving, right? But our bloggers here on FoxProvidence.com, they're pretty much wrapped and ready to go, which is very cool. I'm proud of them. Here's a look at what some of them are saying. Bethany said, mine is done and all wrapped. Tripp said, yes, all done. I did the last of my shopping with a strategic run to the mall on Thursday last week. I'm so relieved. And one artist says, basically, I'm done. So that is good news for all of them. Here's our poll on FoxProvidence.com. Have you finished your holiday shopping? Choices are A, yep, it's all wrapped in under the tree. B, I wish I haven't even started yet. Or C, most of it's done. Odds and ends are left. And uh, we have a few of our friends on Facebook that have left their comments. And Denise Williams is done and wrapped. Kristen Langlis is almost done. And so is Patricia Fargley. She says almost done. So maybe uh, they're just filling up on those stocking stuffers. And you've got a few days to go, so it's not super late yet. But uh, I'll be back at the end of the show to see what you all said in the poll.